Did you know that Undertale's genocide ending was actually different during development? Toby hasn't ever brought this up himself, but by looking in the code of Undertale, you can see that Toby tried to code the game to delete itself after a completed genocide run. It would honestly make a ton of sense for the game to be deleted too, since in the genocide ending, we see Kara slash us until we're left in an empty void, implying the complete erasure of the timeline. It would be a pretty cool ending, and it seems like the only reason it isn't in the final version is because Toby couldn't code it to work correctly, as he seemingly tried a ton of different capitalizations without success. If you found this interesting and like Undertale and Deltarune in general, then why not subscribe for more cool little facts like this one?